Got a deer or roo problem but can't afford an exclusion fence? Pickaxe from Wireman slips over pickets without touching the existing wire. If you have animals getting over a fence and you need to stop them, then you either build a taller fence or raise the height of the existing one. The fence you have may have sunk into the ground due to silt buildup or post subsidence, or it simply wasn't high enough in the first place. Either way, in an agricultural setting, large numbers of animals, other than stock on your property, are either going to mean a loss of pasture and reduced stocking rates, or your livestock become a food source for predators such as wild dogs. So both outcomes will have an impact on your bottom line. So if you can slow down or greatly reduce the movement of animals getting onto your land or your stock getting out, it can have a big impact on profitability. The quicker you deal with the problem, the sooner a solution will provide a return on your investment. Up till now, most landowners raised the fence by either putting in taller posts, using bolt-on brackets, or welding on an extension of some description. Putting in taller posts is expensive. Bolt-on brackets means having to remove the wire from the posts, then tying it back on, which is time consuming. Welding is not always possible because the poor quality steel found in many newly manufactured pickets is often not weldable. Some will say, pull out the fence and start from scratch, but you're not going to be keen to do that if you've just spent thousands of dollars on a not so old fence. So what can be done to easily raise the height of the fence that you have? Well, Wireman produce a range of post extension products that are quick and easy to install all these products are strong and can be attached to an existing fence without removing the wire. They get the job done fast in a highly cost-effective way and all are fully Australian made. Pickex pole stars are made in 300, 600 and 900 millimetre lengths. Best described as a post extension sleeve, they can be used in a variety of ways or in conjunction with standard star pickets or part star picket to raise the height of a fence to virtually any height you may need. Made from 1.5 millimetre thick high tensile galvanised steel, they are strong and robust item. They fit both star pickets used in Australia and all T-posts commonly sold in the USA. With the addition of a Polestar Max, they can be used to extend both beefy and maxi posts. The real beauty of the Polestar system is versatility. They can be used as a standalone item or in conjunction with the PS45 brackets to create the right barrier for your situation. With the addition of the PSTY bracket, a return can be created in both directions to make either T or Y configurations a variable width. A return or offset at the top of a fence can be highly beneficial as it makes it a lot harder for climbing animals such as cats to scale the fence. And if an animal attempting to jump the fence gets caught up, there is a much greater likelihood it will free itself unharmed and not get tangled up in the lower wires. All of the Pickex range of products can be fastened to timber or steel posts using the screw holes provided. This is important as there is always at least one point on the fence, such as a gate, where you may need to improvise a solution to keep a continuous barrier. Pole star sleeves can be used along with short star pickets or cut parts of recycled pickets. If you're trying to stop animals simply jumping the fence, then pairs of two wires close together are better than one wire by itself, as the animals can see the pair better, especially when moving at speed. The key point is that you do not need to have a lot of tension on the wire up high, as there is not going to be any stock pressure high on the fence. You simply need to add strong riser to the end assembly to secure the wire and apply a light tension. All the Pickex Polestar range are used in conjunction with commonly available 12 gauge or 1 inch 25 millimeter self-drilling tech screws. To easily create a high strainer post, get a long heavy duty beefy or maxi star picket for each end post, then fix Polestar Max brackets at the top and bottom of each corner post with a single timber or steel fixing screw. Slide the heavy duty picket down through both brackets, then insert a self-drilling steel screw through both the max bracket and the heavy duty picket to stop it sliding down.
we advise people to consider putting up the fence in stages and leaving the high traffic areas till last so the animals have time to learn where the fence is. Remember, a 60 to 70 kilo animal hitting the fence at speed is going to damage most agricultural fencing. You may have different types of posts on your property and there are many varieties of posts on the market. So it will be virtually impossible to have a perfect fit for all of them. If you want to have a really tight fit or you're having trouble getting Polestar to slide over the particular post you have, a great feature of the Polestar shape is that it can easily be adjusted to suit the size of the post you have. If a Polestar or Polestar Max won't fit over the post, simply take a hammer and placing it with the cut edges on a hard flat surface, strike along the spine of the Polestar to widen it out. You may have to do this more than once until it fits. On the other hand, if you find they are a bit loose, place one edge of the pole star on a hard flat surface and strike the hammer along the opposite edge to squash it down until it's a neat fit. These are just some of the ways Pickex and pole star can be used. Printable drawings for all of the ideas shown in this video can be downloaded from our website at wireman.com.au. And if you have any questions or problems, please get in touch and let us know your thoughts. Thanks for your time.